So welcome to Blatty live stream. We have live streams not every day, but during the live stream, guys, we have lucky time of unlimited discounts and huge giveaways. So please welcome your friends, invite them in, guys. If it's your first time and you haven't followed us yet, don't forget to follow us. But first of all, greetings to everybody. It's a good day today, guys, and it's a perfect opportunity for us to give you guys great discounts. Maybe you've been looking for a portable power station for yourself, for your family, for your friends, maybe as a gift even. And of course, as everybody, we're looking for the best prices, okay, for various discounts. But guys, right now is the best time ever. During our last one, we have the best prices because we give you guys those discounts that are only valid during the live stream. So guys, make sure that you use them in the live stream because once this live stream is over, discounts are gone. Once more time, my name is Tim and this is Blady. Okay guys, maybe you don't know what Blady is. So Blady is dedicated to making this world really a better place because you know we all want to switch from those gas run generators to green energy generators or not even generators, portable power stations that are absolutely eco-friendly, environmentally friendly, they are quiet, they are very cost effective and they are really relatively lightweight compared to other portable power stations. Regardless of what you're using it for, maybe for a small trip or maybe for your life in van, maybe you're living off grid, maybe you're experiencing power outages, maybe you just want to grab something to charge your devices from on a picnic or you know on a small rendezvous. So in cases like this and many others guys, you probably want to be looking for a portable power station. So Blady portable power stations are one more time, are all eco-friendly, they are gas-free, they are very cost-effective and they are environmentally free. So today guys, during the live stream we have two hours, okay? During these two hours I'll be presenting you guys this portable power stations from smaller to bigger ones and also we'll be doing giveaways. What do we give away? So we give away on Facebook and on YouTube and to participate in this giveaway all you want to do is to really just follow, share with your friends and be active in the comments because we are choosing the most active one in the comments. We will be doing, last, uh, we will be doing giveaways for YouTube and for Facebook, okay? So make sure that you are very active there. And don't forget to share this lesson with your friends and give it a like. We're giving away a K2 power bank, it's a very portable, it's a very powerful a bank, 130 watts, it can charge your laptops, your phones, your other gadgets for eight plus hours. We also giving away this t-shirt from Blad, it says power on three times, very pleasant to touch, skin friendly, very cool t-shirts. We also giving away our hats from Blady. And again guys, if you wanna take part in this giveaway, follow, share, and be active in the comments, the most important thing. Okay. After I present you guys this portable power stations, we'll release a special discount. Okay, the discount is gonna be the link in the comments section on Facebook and on YouTube. So make sure that you go there and click on that link because this link is only valid during the live stream. Okay, make sure you're very, very quick. So right now, call your friends and we get started. And at the end, if we have time, I'll reply to your guys' questions and if you have any questions, do ask in the comments. Our customer service will reply to your questions in the comments on YouTube or on Facebook. So today we're talking about portable power stations, smaller ones, bigger ones, massive ones, and also our solar panels. So let's kick things off with the first part of our collection, which is going to be AC50S. AC50S comes in many colors. So it has orange, blue, and gray three colors, I counted, and this is a, let's put it this way, okay, so this is a 300 watts AC pure sine wave inverter portable power station, the surge is 450 watts, uh, the capacity is 500 watts hour, and the battery chemistry is lithium ion battery. So with 1,000 plus life cycles after the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. It has 11 outputs, AC and DC outputs, and three ways to recharge it. 
So we have AC, we can just plug it in our wall outlet and recharge from there. We also have a solar recharging option to recharge from our photovoltaic solar panels. We can also recharge from a car a cigarette lighter or a 12 volt power socket from your car. And those are three ways to recharge it. And the maximum solar input is 120 watts. And as always, it's eco-friendly, it's gas-free and very cost-effective and very quiet. Okay, so right now, let's take a closer look, guys, at ACE50S. So ACE50S is an entry level, I would say. If you have never used a portable power station before, it's a good idea to try with AC50S, okay? Because just treat it as a gadget. You can choose a favorite color, blue, gray, or orange. And think about it as a very powerful power bank with a bunch of different outputs, okay? We have AC, DC, including a wireless output here on the top. Speaking about outputs, guys, let's take a closer look, okay? So, 11 outputs, so what do we have here? Starting with number one, which is here, DC output, okay, 12 volts and three amps, so, fifth, so it's um, 36 watts in total, and we have two of them, this is for some old school TVs, for radios, for some other devices, this is not very popular, but here, bordering it is very popular, a car power socket, 12 volt car power socket, 12 volts and 10 amps, so this is a 120 watts, so maybe you have some uh, fridges that use this car power socket. This is the uh, this is the output, by the way. This is not the input. So this is to you know charge other devices from this output. So maybe you have some fans, some refrigerators, or any other devices that use you know <clears throat> car power socket port, cigarette lighter port, and just uh, look at the uh, voltage here and the amperage, and you can use your device with it. Here we have DC outputs, okay? So this is a type C and it's rated at 45 watts. So this is for your MacBook, this is for your other type C devices. Below we have four USB type A ports, okay? So this is five volts and three amps uh, USB ports. This is for our, you know, some lower energy consuming devices such as Android phones and uh, the gadgets like this. So we have four of them. So if you want to recharge your gadgets like your Android phones and other devices, it's not a problem and you can do four of them at the same time. Here we also have some LED lights, you know, that we can recharge from uh, USB-A port and even a small fan that we'll be loading later. And here we have my favorite one, which is AC output, 120 volts and 300 watts. And the surge is 450 watts. The surge is very important because when you plug any device in and actually start running it, it experiences a so-called spike. So the highest wattage, okay? The time it consumes the most power. So the surge is 450 watts and the maximum is 300 watts. So which actually answers the question, what device you can use with this? Well, actually any devices under 300 watts would work perfectly fine with ASA50S. And finally, on the top, we have this wireless pad, which is rated at um, 10 watts. So if your phone or any gadget supports wireless charging, just put it on the top here and you, know, you can just charge it this way. Here we have very nice carrying handles. Okay, and on the back side we have this light, which I absolutely love. So to turn the light on, you want to make sure you turn the whole thing on first, and then let's take a look at the light. It's a very nice ambient light, which is not that it's not like targeted light. It's very nice if you do some journaling, some writing, maybe even drawing, or some other things. This light would be a cool thing to use, and it also has an SOS mode. Okay, so this is the light. Guys, look, once I turn this on, the screen lit up, and the screen is actually very nice. It says the input, the output, and it also shows the battery life. So the battery is right now 100%. I know it's not precise, these are like bars, but it's better than nothing, right? At least you can see the battery, the frequency, the input, and the output. And here we can uh, turn DC on if we need to, and AC on, the same, and off. Okay. Right now, let's actually uh, try to use some device with it. 
like bait this fan, this USB fan. Okay, this is using USB type A port and we have four of them here. So I wanna make sure my DC outputs are on and those are on right now. And I'm turning this on, okay. Um, it does not draw any power right now because the load is like too low. But we do have this LED lamp here. So also we're trying to use it with a USB type A port right now, okay. All right, the lamp is on as you guys can see. Let's check the screen. Okay, three watts it shows right now. Three watts from DC output. SC outputs are vacant right now. So just was thinking, instead of plugging everything in and testing it, we already prepared some data for you guys. So let's say you're charging your phone like iPhone X. So you can give your iPhone X 42 full, 42 plus full charges. Can you, can you believe that? 42 plus full charges to your iPhone X. Now tell me what power bank can do this, right? Now, if you're turning your laptop, you can give your laptop, assuming that your laptop is around 60 watts, you can give your laptop seven to eight full charges. If you charge your, let's say, um, LED lamp, not even charge if you run your LED lamp, which is just like hours, 10 or even five, I think it's just five watts, you can run your lamp for 45 hours. If you run a router, Wi-Fi router with this, which is around nine watts, you can run your router for around 25 hours. If you're running your CPAP, which is around, you know, um, I don't know, 40 watts probably, you can run for 50 to 40 hours. If you run your fridge, which is around 40 watts, mini fridge, right? You can run it for 10 to 15 hours. So this is some data for you guys. Right now we are running our lamp and our fan perfectly fine, no problem at all. And how about we utilize one of the AC outputs because we do have two of them, okay, and charge our drone battery. So this is our drone battery. Right now after I plug it in, I wanna turn it on or vice versa, the, it doesn't really matter. So let's see if it is charting or not right now. Okay, yes, it is charting right now, you can see. So let's see the load. Okay, it's 59 watts right now from the AC output. So this is really cool, this is really nice. So guys, as we already said, 500 watts hour of capacity, massive capacity, 300 watts AC pure insane wave inverter, 450 watts surge, and the battery life of 1000 plus life cycles after which the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. So pretty nice, again, an entry level. If you take it with you on a picnic, on a beach, or you know, on a small meetup with your friends, it will be a very popular guy or a girl with this portable power station at hand. <clears throat> it's really nice, again, the battery is lithium ion, so it's lightweight and still the, the capacity is 500 watts and the lifespan is quite nice, 1000 plus life cycles. It's not short at all. We have this light, we have this wireless uh, charting pad, so no cords needed. We have this nice carrying handle and the service that protects it from dropping. And when it drops, it protects a little bit and non-slipping service here on the button. It's really nice and it's really lightweight, by the way. Let's talk about how lightweight it is, okay? And actually the dimensions, how big it is, how wide, how tall, how high, etc. So, and don't forget, that you can choose any color. We have like gray, blue, and orange. So choose your favorite one. Okay, guys, so let's keep moving. Okay, let's keep moving, guys. All right, and by the way, if you have any questions, do let me know in the comments. Uh, I, will, I will not see your comments, but my colleagues will, and they will reply to your questions. So, okay, dimensions. Again, guys, as I said, it's ultra lightweight. It's only 13.6 pounds, okay? So the length is 11.6 inches, 11.6 inches, the width is 7.5 inches, and the depth is 7.7 .7 inches. And again, the weight is only 13.6 pounds. For uh, all of our products, you guys will have a warranty, okay? During which if something goes wrong with the product, maybe, you know, it's malfunctioning, you will get it repaired for free, or you will get it returned, you can return it. So for this, for SFTS, you have 24 months of absolutely hassle-free uh, guarantee, okay? So 24 months for this one. Okay, guys, uh, open the box. When you actually receive it, what do you have in the box? First of all, we have SFTS, one more time, 
300 watts AC pure same wave inverter, 450 watts surge, 1000 plus life cycles, uh, lithium ion battery, and um, 120 watts of maximum solar input. You also will have an AC adapter and a cable. Let me show it to you guys. So you will have an AC adapter and a cable. This is number one. What you will have in the box. You don't have to purchase it separately. Included in the box. And please take a look here, guys. We have all the accessories listed for you guys here. Number two, we have this uh, car charging cable. Okay, this is car to um, <clears throat> the cigarette lighter cable, cigarette, uh, cigarette port. Okay. Yep. Cigarette port to DC7909 connector mail. There we go. Okay. Then we also have uh, this MC4 cable, MC4 connector to, to, to uh, DC7909 mail. This is to connect it to your uh, solar panels. Okay. All right. And we also have a user manual and a service card. So this is what is included in the box. What is not included in the box are solar panels. But we'll talk about them later. So you can purchase solar panels from us or you can have your own solar panels. I mean, um, yeah, so we'll talk about them later. For now, guys, um, <clears throat> let's talk about Bloody EB55. How about discount? Is the discounted link ready? Is it ready or not? Let me know, guys. Because discounts are very important. We are here for discounts. So yes, for Bloody S50S, we have discount. Original price is $379. Discounted price is $299.99. So guys, make sure you use it right now. The link is in the comments section. And we are moving on the next part of our collection. Okay, let's turn it off. Let's move to EB55. So EB55, okay. Oh, hold on a second. Probably it won't be EB55. Anyway, guys, right now we have, uh, anyway, I guess right now I have extra time. Talk about uh, SFTS. Again, SFTS has a super discounted price right now. Here we still have all the accessories that we have right here. Okay, okay, so right now, guys, let's move to EB55. Okay, EB55, there we go. It comes in blue, as I have it right here, because it's blue Eddie. Uh, it comes in gray and in orange. So, Bloody EB55. The wattage is higher compared to SFTS. This is 700 watts AC pure insane wave inverter. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. And <clears throat> 1,400 watts surge. The uh, capacity is 537 watts hour, massive capacity. The lithium, uh, the battery chemistry is lithium iron phosphate battery, so life, uh, life PO4 or lithium uh, from PO4, uh, with 2,500 plus life cycles before the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. It has 12 different outputs for multiple devices and has six ways to recharge it. This is AC from your wall outlet. If you're home, if you have this privilege of an AC outlet. Um, also, you can recharge from solar or from your solar panels, okay? From your car power socket, from another generator, you can even combine charging methods to speed the whole process up dramatically. So you can do AC from your wall outlet and solar at the same time. Guess what? You can even do dual AC simultaneously. So it will speed up the charging process dramatically. So if you guys are wondering, the maximum solar input you can get as high as 200 watts and the maximum fast dual charging input uh, this is solar plus AC adapter simultaneously is 400 watts. And again, it's eco-friendly, it's gas free, it's super cost-effective and it's super quiet too. And right now, guys, we also have a special discount. Use link in the comments. Original price, $499. Discounted price, $449. Okay. Right now, let's take a closer look at the outputs because the outputs is one of the selling points. You know, it can compete with power banks because it's so powerful, but also because it has 
all those outputs. And in this case, it has 12 outputs, okay? Those are AC and DC, including a wireless pad on the top here, which is rated at 15 watts. This is for your gadgets that support wireless charging, like your smartphones, you know, all iPhones do, uh, newer ones. And now we also have some uh, earphones, charging cases, some uh, watches and other devices. Okay, let's take a closer look. Starting from a car power socket, which is DC output, a 12 volt car power socket. This is for your fridges, for some devices that run on this car power socket. Go ahead and, and plug it in. Bordering it is 12 volts and 10 amps, so 120 watts. DC outputs, this is for a radio, this is probably not very popular right now. Let me know guys in the comments if what device you use with this outputs. I don't think you use many devices with this outputs, but Anyway, we have two of them here. Okay, here we have DC output still. So this is a USB type C output. This is very popular. You know, this is for your MacBook. This is for your other devices. USB type C output is really cool for your iPhone. And take a look guys, this 100 watts. This is very fast. If you guys remember on A50S, for example, we had only at 45 watts. Usually you will see the wattage around 45 to 65 watts, but here it's 100 watts. So it's ultra fast charting for your MacBook, for your iPhone, and for other devices to use type C. Here we have USB type A, and we have four, four outputs, right at five volts and three amps, so 15 watts four USB A ports. Again, we, run, we just ran our LED light, our fan, and we can run so many devices with USB type A ports. We have four of them. And here, AC outputs 100 to 120 volts and 700 watts. And a pure sine wave inverter. The surge is 1,400 watts. So we have two, um, use, two AC outputs here. So this is for some devices that just think about it like any device you can plug in your wall outlet, you can plug in here, be it your fridge, be it your ice maker, coffee machine, sandwich maker, um, air conditioner, whatever it is. So just plug it in here. And you see guys, we have a pure and sine wave here. Okay, so these are the outputs. Plus on the top, we also have a wireless charging pad. This is for your device that support wireless charging. And of course, on the back side, it's not an output, but still it's a very nice feature. We have this light. Okay, let me show you this light because this light is pretty cool. Okay, so this light, let's turn it on. It has two levels of brightness and it does have an SOS mode or a party mode. Again, a very nice ambient light. It's really cool, really, you know, good looking. <laughs> okay, and the current handle on the top here. So. These are the outputs. Outputs are great because they allow us to deliver power from this portable power station to our devices to recharge them. But speaking about recharging, how can we recharge this thing itself? How can we recharge it? Well, actually, there are many ways to recharge it. So first of all, guys, we have our AC adapter input, right? This is the wall outlet. This is probably the best way to do this and you will get the maximum input of 200 watts. And you will be able to recharge it, the whole thing uh, within just three hours, very fast. But what if you live off grid? What if you don't have an opportunity to recharge from AC outlet? Well, in this case, you can just go ahead and recharge from your solar panels, right? It's also an option. And the maximum input will be as high as your AC adapter input, 200 watts maximum and you will get a recharge within three hours. This is of course with prime sunshine, with um, good ambient temperature, also with, you know, on a sunny day and including some other factors. So, but around three hours. You can even combine AC plus solar for even a faster charging and you will get a recharge um, from 1.8 to 2.3 hours, and you will get the input as high as 400 watts. Now you can also do car input, 12 volt or 24 volt cigarette lighter, um, and you can get it recharged within 6.1 or 3.4 hours from cigarette lighter port, 
in your car. Not the fastest way to do this, but still it's a good option. Okay guys, and right now we announced a special discount. So original price for EBA 55 is $499 and discounted price is $449. Please use the link in the comment section below because all the links are only available and valid during the live stream. Okay guys, and take a look here we have this discounts over here. And by the way, here we have our social platforms like Facebook, Blady Global, and Instagram, Blady underscore official. Also follow us on YouTube, Blady, and Blady support, and visit our website, bladypower.com. Okay, great. Right now, after we talked about how can we recharge it, let's talk about how long it can charge or uh, run various devices of ours. So let's start from the most vital one, which is CPAP. If your CPAP is 40 watts, you can run your CPAP for 11 plus hours. If you run at TV, which is 75 watts, you can run it for five to six hours. So maybe during the power outage, you haven't finished your Netflix show, you can just go ahead and plug it in. Yeah, exactly, like the, the TV uses USB, uh, no, not USB, uses AC, right? So just plug it in, like you plug it into your wall, but this is your wall right now. Plug it in here and that's it, guys, and run it to the, honestly, even think of it, I don't know, it's so bizarre. Like, you can just literally plug your TV in this thing and watch your TV. For me, like, TV has to be plugged in the wall outlet, but hey, we have the wall outlet here. So guys, it's crazy, but you will get used to it. So if you have like a power outage, okay, or I don't know, maybe you're outdoors and you wanna watch TV outdoors, like in here, five to six hours to 75 watt TV. If you use it with your electric tools, speaking about outdoors, right, or indoors, if you're using with your electric tools, you can run your electric tools at around 80 watts for five to six hours. Okay, right now let's move to some lightweight devices like your phone, your smartphone, right? So assuming your smartphone is around 10 watts hour, it draws around 10, uh, uh, 10 watts hour. So this is like newer smartphones. You can give your smartphone 40 to 50 charges, full charges. Now, if you're running your LED lamp, which is 20 watts, and 20 watts is, uh, is rather a big LED lamp, okay? Now, you can run your LED lamp for 20 to 30 hours. If you run a refrigerator, which is around 90 watts, you can run it for seven plus hours. And if you run a slow cooker, which is 200 watts, you can run your slow cooker for two to three hours. And if you run your rice cooker, which is around 300 watts, you can run for one to 1.5 hours. Uh, also take into account, guys, these numbers are showing if you only run or charge this device alone. So don't entirely rely on them because in reality, probably it's gonna be lower than that because most likely you would love to use it like, you know, with different devices at the same time. And I totally encourage that because, hey, you can do this, no problem. You can charge your phone here from wireless charging output on the top. You can, you know, charge your USB um, on a phone, your MacBook from Type C, and AC at the same time. So the total user channel will drop down, but you know you will be able to charge at the same time very fast, no problem, because it has 700 watts of um, AC pure and same wave inverter. Uh, this is speaking about AC. Okay, guys, so right now we have our first giveaway time. Very happy time. And we announce winners every 20 minutes. So the first giveaway is giveaway over a K2 power bank, which has 130 watts. And uh, it can charge your phones, your other gadgets, and your computer, your, your laptops. Very nice power bank, and right now we're giving it away. Let's see who our winner is. And our first winner is from Facebook, okay? So congratulations to, to Teresa Deaton. Okay, Teresa Deaton, congratulations. Teresa, please kindly contact Avalon at bluetti.com for the shipment within 48 hours from now. 
One more time, Teresa, congratulations. And guys, if you want to win, just like Teresa, all you wanna do is to follow us, to share with your friends, and give us your likes, and most importantly, okay, most importantly, be active in the comments. Be active in the comments on Facebook, on YouTube, on both, and in this way, you will be probably chosen by our team as a winner of our giveaway. We give away our t-shirts, we give away our um, hats, we give away our K2 power banks. So it's a great, great day. Um, live streams, we have giveaways during live stream. Okay, so right now, let's get back to EBA 55. And a very common question is, does it have a pass-through charting or can it be charged and discharged at the same time? In other words, you know, can we charge it, let's say, with solar and use it? So the answer is yes, guys, you can do this, no problem. Dimensions, the length is 10.94 inches, the width is 7.87 inches, the depth is 7.79 inches, and the weight, and you're gonna love it, is only 16.5 pounds, lightweight. Operating temperature, so if you actually use it 55, okay, you can use it, you can discharge it anywhere from minus four to 104 degrees Fahrenheit. If you just store it, like, you know, put it there without using it, you cannot, uh, you, you cannot just store it like under very low temperature, so you can go from 14 to 113 degrees Fahrenheit. Certifications, guys, if it rings a bell, it has ULC, CDOE, FCC, CA Prop 65, those are some cool certifications, you know, and it has the warranty for 24 months, okay? 24 months of warranty, hassle-free, don't worry about it, just relax, you know, play it safe, you have the warranty. Open the box, what is there? First of all, we have an AC adapter, and this is our AC adapter and a charting cable. There we, there we go. Super lightweight, by the way. I anticipate the questions, super lightweight. I promise you that, I love it. It is so tiny, so cool. This is an AC adapter and a charging cable. Okay, second one is our car charging cable. This is XT60 uh, to uh, female. Okay, there's a car charging cable. Number three, we have the uh, solar charging cable. Okay, so this is to connect to, connect to your solar panels and to the portable power station. And of course we have the user manual, very user friendly, very, uh, and with geeky details too. And we also have the warranty for 24 months. So this is what you have in the box, guys. Right now, guys, we open a special discount for EB, uh, for EB55, okay? So original price is $499, discount price is $499. $49. Please take a look here. You guys see the original price and discounted price. Please use the link in the comment section. Click on that link and save a lot of money. You want to purchase it? Purchase it right now, guys. Right now is the best time. The prices are the best, okay? This is EV55. Our portable power station of 800 watts of 716 watts, our massive capacity. Oh, it's actually 700 watts here, uh, sorry, 700 watts, yeah. And uh, uh, with 12 different outputs, with um, lithium iron phosphate battery, 2,500 plus life cycles, with six ways to recharge it. And you can do it as fast as like within three hours normally from uh, your solar panels or from AC outlet. So guys, go for it right now, the prices are the best. We also have this nice screen that shows us the input, the output, and the frequency, and the battery life. Basically everything we need. Okay, let's move on to EB70S, okay? EB70S looks very similar, but it's bigger, and it's still very lightweight. Okay, so let's take a look, guys. This is EB70S portable power station. So the uh, AC pure same wave inverter is 800 watts and uh, the surge is 1,400 watts. <clears throat> so it has the capacity of 716 watts hour. Massive capacity, you can say. Uh, lithium iron phosphate battery, 
with uh, 2,500 plus life cycles before the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. It has 12 different outputs and six ways to recharge it. This is AC, this is solar, your cigarette lighter port, uh, generator, AC plus solar simultaneously and dual AC simultaneously. The maximum solar input is 200 watts and as always, it's eco-friendly, it's gas-free, it's cost-effective and it's very, very quiet. So right now, let's take a closer look at the outputs here. We have AC and we have DC, including a wireless charging pad on the top, which is rated at 15 watts, okay? This is for your gadgets that support wireless charging. And let's take a closer look at the outputs here. So let's start from here. So first of all, guys, we have this cigarette lighter, 12 volt, okay? You know how to use it for some fridges, for many devices, they can use um, this cigarette lighter port. Okay, it is 12 volts. Now here we have 12 volts and 10 amps, so we have 20 watts. Um, this is for maybe older people, for older generation, so for some radios, for some like old school TVs, or Wi-Fi routers, etc. But here we have uh, two USB-A ports, and this is five volts and three amps, so 15 watts. So this is to run our small fans, some um, LED lamps, etc. And here my favorite one is we have two USB Type-C ports, 100 watts each, so it's a very fast charging, just think about it. Normally you would only get like uh, 45 or 65 watts, but here we have 100 watts and we have two of them, guys. This is really cool. Okay, let's move to AC outputs, okay? AC outputs, we have four of those, 100 to 120 volts and 800 watts. And again, guys, as you can see right now, don't take my word for it, you can see it right here, it's sine wave, okay? And of course, on the top, we have a light. It's a very bright light. Okay, sorry if I blinded someone. So it has different brightness and an SOS mode, which hopefully you will never use, but sometimes can be very handy. Okay, and on the top, we have this wireless pad for your smartphone. So absolutely cord-free charting. Boom, put it on the top in the center, and it's charting very well. So guys, here we also have a nice screen, right? It shows us the input, it shows us the output, the frequency, which is standard 60 hertz in the USA. In some countries, it is uh, 50 hertz, but here it's 60 hertz. Okay, and we also have the battery life. Okay, we have this uh, battery life here. So basically everything we really need. Okay guys, right now, don't forget that during the last week we have a special price for uh, our EB70S. So original price is $569 and discounted price is $499. It's a great discount guys. One more time, let's take a look here. It's $569 that is marked down to only $499. So if you want to get a discount, all you wanna do is to click on the link, okay, in the comments section. Please be quick because all of these discounts are only valid during the live stream. Okay, after we talked about all these outputs and the ways to deliver the power, the energy from this portable power station to other devices, be it our phones, be it our computers, laptops, TVs, sandwich makers, coffee machines, etc., 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 we want to talk about how to recharge it, okay, because it's very important. So, first of all, we have the first way is AC adapter. Plug it in the wall outlet. You will get 200 watts uh, maximum, and you will be able to recharge EB70S from four to four and a half hours. The second option, which is very popular, and I love it because it's, you know, it's eco-friendly. It's solar, okay, solar panels. You will get 200 watts maximum input, and again, the same, you will be able to recharge it from four to four and a half hours. This is, of course, with uh, prime sunshine, ordeal orientation, you know, the angle you place the solar panel to the sun at, and also the good temperature, around 77 degrees Fahrenheit, and goes good solar, solar intensity, okay? And finally, last but not least, we have our car cigarette lighter, 12 or 24 volt car outlet, and depending on whether it's 12 volt and 100 watts, or uh, sorry, 12 volt and 200 watts or 24 volt and 100 
no, the vice versa. Anyway, you got it. Uh, you will be able to charge with 7.5 or four hours. So think about it, 7.5 to four hours, well, maybe if you're on a long trip, okay, or maybe if it's the only way you can charge it, yeah, it's not a bad idea, but if you have solar panels, so we'll talk about later, or if you have an AC outlet, guys, you will be able to charge it as fast as uh, within four hours. Okay, when it's uh, fully recharged and ready to deliver power to other devices, how long we can run or recharge other devices? Let's think about it. So, uh, for example, we want to recharge our phone. Okay, let's take our phone and our phone will be like 2815 milliamp hour. So we'll be able to give our phone 50 full charges. 50 full charges. This is like for 50 days, I guess. Okay, next. If we want to recharge our laptop, which is 60 watts hour, we can give our laptop 9 to 10 full charges. Let's say you have a tablet, you want to recharge your tablet. Your tablet is 30 watts hour. So you can recharge your tablet 20 times, okay? If you run a LED lamp, a small LED lamp around 10 watts, you can run your LED lamp for LED lamps for 53 plus hours, okay? Okay, so if you run your camera, if you charge your camera, I should say, which is around 16 watts hour, you can charge your camera for 36 plus times. If you charge your drone battery that I actually have right here and we already charged it, you can charge it for eight plus charges. This is around 60 watts hour, draws around 60 watts hour. So um, if you run a small fan, which is um, around 30 watts hour, you can run it for 18 hours, 18 hours straight. If you recharge your switch, let's say, okay, which is 25 watts, you can, you, can, um, you can run or recharge your switch for 96 hours. And finally, if you run a coffee maker, okay, you can run it for 62 minutes, for, so like for more than an hour. Okay guys, right now, let's just sum it up quickly. 800 watts, 1,400 uh, surge, 12 different outputs, AC and DC, including the wireless output on the top. And I also love how lightweight it is. Let's see the dimensions for our EB70S because it's very light. So I wonder what is the exact weight. It's 21.4 pounds, super lightweight. The length is 12.6 inches, the width is 8.5 inches, and the depth is 8.7 inches. The operating temperature is from minus four to 104 degrees Fahrenheit. The storage temperature is from 14 to 113 degrees Fahrenheit. It has the warranty of 24 months. And it also comes in different colors. Okay guys, right now, when you open the box, what do you have there? First of all, we have the portable power station itself. Then we have various accessories, such as AC adapter plus charging cable, for example, okay? So this is an AC adapter and a charging cable number one, and please take a look guys, we have all the accessories here. Number two, we have this uh, car charting cable. Okay, it's very stable by the way, is our car charting cable. Then we have this solar charting cable. Okay, let me show you this solar charting cable. All right, great. And of course we have a user manual, we have a warranty card, and we have a certificate of the quality pass. Okay, great guys, and if you purchase right now, you get all those accessories and you also will get this special discount right here that will allow you to save a lot of money. And right now, we do our second giveaway for today, guys. Remember, a long time ago, we did our first giveaway, and right now is our second time. Yes, guys, exactly. We'll announce winners every 20 minutes, right? We're giving away this nice hat. Please take a look, this hat is really cool. I love it a lot. And this time our winner is from YouTube because last time it was from, 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 from Facebook. So right now it's from YouTube. Congratulations to our winner from YouTube. This is KC83. KC83 is key, uh, K-A-C-E-Y 83. KC, please kindly contact 
evelyn at blady.com within 48 hours for a shipment. Guys, if you want to win just like Casey did, all you want to do is to follow us, share with your friends, give us your like, and be very active in the comments because if you're active in the comments, you will be probably chosen for our giveaway. So congratulations to Casey one more time. You got it. Okay. Right now, guys, one more time, giveaways are fantastic. But you know what is even better? Our discounts. I think our discounts are great. Sad part is that they only valid during the live stream. But still, guys, we have time, okay? We have time, don't panic. And right now, we can get it at a special price. For IBA 55, original price is $499, okay? And discounted price is $449. This is for IBA 55. For IBA 70S, yes, original price is $500. $69. Its current price is $499. Use the link in the comments right now. Save a lot of money. While we are moving on a bigger and more powerful and more capable portable power station, Bloody AC300 Inverter Module Generator. Ta -da! It's coming. Oh my God, guys. So it's very big, but you might think it is actually very lightweight. The reason, why it's because, the reason why it's so lightweight is because it does not have battery inside. Yes, you heard, me, you heard me right. It does not have any battery inside, but it is expandable with up to four different, up to four batteries, okay, either with B300s or with, oh, um, so it's, no, sorry, it's only with B300. Yeah, it's only with B300. B300 is here, by the way, so this is heavy, okay, so I'm not going to be able to lift it like this. So if it's expandable with um, B300, okay, you can get the capacity up to 12,288 watts hour, guys, just think about it. If it's expandable, if it's expanded with one B300 battery I have right here, you will get the capacity of 3,072 watts hour, okay, and 3,000 watts AC pure insane wave inverter and 6,000 6, watts of surge, okay? Again, the capacity when expanded with one B300 is 3,072 watts hour and the capacity when it's expanded with um, four B300s, you will get 12,288 watts hour. So this does not have a battery inside, okay? But uh, B300 does. And right now, let me put it on the top. But before I put it on the top, guys, let me show you that we have this wireless charging output here on the top, okay? So if you want to profit from them, make sure that you put A300 on the top of B300. That is actually, I'm gonna do right now. So first of all, oh, this is heavy. This is very heavy. But this is because, guys, it has lithium iron phosphate battery. You probably heard about those batteries. Very safe, very, very long lifespan. Specifically, 3,500 plus life cycles before the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. This is the beast, guys. It will uh, get you through the power outages. It will help you when you're on the go and you don't have any source of energy. It will help you run your gadgets, your phones, your tablets, etc. And not even, not only this, most importantly, guys, you will be able to charge things like your refrigerators, okay? So will you, not, you will not spoil those products that are worth um, hundred, uh, hundred, uh, hundreds of dollars uh, in your fridge during power outages, okay, hurricane season, or, you know, just like a blackout, you don't have to throw them away, just plug your fridge in here, okay, and uh, be able to save your, um, your food, and, you know, just don't have to change your lifestyle during the power outages. So, by the way, when I put it like this, guys, it does not expand, uh, like, magically. We have this fusion cable that I'll show you guys later. So, um, we have to actually connect it with the fusion cable. And if I try to turn this on right now, as you guys can see, it does not turn on because as you have it, it does not have the battery inside. So this is just battery, okay? And you might be thinking like, oh, why would you do it this way? The cool thing about it is that, guys, you, you uh, let me ask you. So 
when our portable power station just like we, we cannot use it like after 10 years, 15 years, 20 years, whatever. This is because something's wrong with the battery, right? So in this case, if the battery just like too old, right? After like 15, 20 years, we can just buy another battery. They said you don't have to buy another AC300. So this is the cool thing about it. Okay, and uh, a lithium iron phosphate battery with 3,500 plus life cycles, again, will serve for years, years, and years. It does have split bonding too. And uh, let, right now let's talk about the outputs. So the cool thing about it is that we have the outputs of AC300 here, which are actually 16 uh, versatile outlets for 99% of your appliances. Okay, starting with DC outputs from here, which is 12 volts and DC 30 amps. Okay, so this is probably for those who live in the, in the van. And uh, here we have 24 volts DC 10 amps. And we have a warning here, guys. 24 volts DC output only. Don't mix with DC 12 volts. So 24 volts. Make sure the voltage is the same. Okay. Here we have the C outputs, USB type C, 100 watts. Again, 100 watts, very, very fast charging, right? USB type A, we have two, we have four of them, four of them. So this is gonna be 18 watts and we have two of them. Again, uh, five volts, three amps, 15 watts here and 18 watts here. Okay, and here we have AC outputs, 3000 watts. 100 to 120 uh, volts, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six. And here we have uh, 20 amps maximum, okay? Here's 30 amps maximum for some very, very energy consuming devices, okay? This is uh, near to 30. So for very energy consuming devices, guys, you have this uh, output right here. All right, great. And we also have two wireless charging outputs here on the top, okay, so we can charge our phones. But again, when it's active, it is actually on, right now it's off. Okay, and we also have the outputs of B300 itself. So we have one more USB uh, A output here, USB C output, which is 100 watts, very fast. USB A output is also 18 watts, which is like three watts faster than the normal output. And we also have 12 volts DC, 10 amps, Ka secret lighter port. And here we have the indicator of the battery. Okay, so we, we will see uh, what, how much time we have left, or not, not time, like what percentage we have of the battery left. Okay, right now guys, I turned on, and how do we recharge B300? So we can recharge from AC, so just plug it in in the wall outlet, AC charging cable input is 300 watts maximum. We can also recharge from our solar panels. The solar input is 2,400 watts maximum. Of course, you have to buy a lot of solar panels. Uh, make sure those are within 12 to 150 volts. Uh, car input, 12 or 24 volts from cigarette lighter port and AC and solar sim simultaneously. So the input will be as high as 5,400 watts. This is like a crazy input. And let's talk about dimensions right now. I guess probably can tell it's uh, quite a big thing. So the weight of AC300 is 47.6 uh, pounds. Okay, 47.6 pounds. It's very lightweight. The dimensions, the length is uh, 20.5 inches. Okay, the width is 12.5 inches and the height is 14.1 inches. So again, this AC300, uh, AC300 is very lightweight, but B300 is heavy. Okay, let's keep moving, guys. Let's keep moving. When you open the box of AC300, what do you have there? So first of all, we have a 15 amps charting cable. Let's have a closer look. Okay, this is a 15 uh, amp AC charting cable. Then we have a solar charging cable, MC4 to aviation plug. Okay. And please take a look. We have all the accessories on the screen. We also have a car charging cable, cigarette lighter uh, M to MC4. It's very stable. And we have a user manual. We have a QC card. 
and uh, we have a four year warranty card. Four year warranty card. Okay, so right now our B300 is on. This is the battery. Can B300 be used on its own? Yes, it absolutely can. It does have some outputs, right? But not many. So what we want to do is we want to extend it with uh, A300 for a higher capacity and for just more outputs. So for A300 right now we run a special price. Original price guys, <laughs> original price is $1,899 and discounted price is $1,000. $699. Let's do it one more time. Original price is $1,899. Discounted price, $1,699. Guys, you don't have to be good at math to calculate how much you're saving right now, but please be quick because all the discounts are available only during the live stream, guys. So please be very, very quick. One more time, here are all the accessories you will see. And here is the discounted price, guys. And I actually really want to extend it right now with this Fusion cable. I'm holding, yeah, it's a big cable, but if the cable is big, it misses a lot of current running through it. So we can go ahead and extend it or expand it. I think it's expand. So, um, or maybe extend, I'm not sure. So anyway, uh, do you guys see the process? So I just kind of, you know, plug it in and then I have to lock it, okay? Lock, lock, and right now, woo, it's on. Do you remember I actually turned on already? But because it does not have any battery, so it couldn't turn on. Right now, it's expanded, so it works. Okay, well, what is this? This is actually a nice screen that we want to talk about, right? So we'll talk about the screen. Before we talk about the screen, I want to tell you one more time that the capacity expended is 3,072 watts hour, okay? So 3,072 watts hour. This is actually the capacity of B300. I mean, duh, because this is the battery. So lithium iron phosphate battery. Uh, 3,500 plus life cycles before the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. And if you just want to purchase, purchase it right now, because you want to say $200, right? No problem, guys. You can do it right now. You can just store it. You can store it for like six months, three months, doesn't matter. Just remember to recharge it to 80% every three to six months, okay? So it does have MPPT controller battery management system, etc. So it uh, helps you, you know, use it wisely to extend the longevity of the product. Okay, so this is for your home backup, guys. If you experience, if you experience power outages, things like this, uh, you don't have to suffer from them anymore because you can just, you know, go ahead and have this home backup system. Anytime that, uh, anytime that you have a power outage, go ahead and use this system instead. Okay, all right, guy, quick sip of water. Great, okay, let's keep diving into it. One more time, um, because we get asked a lot, is a B300, like, can it be used on its own? Uh, yes, it can. Let's just take a look at this, guys. So this is the battery, okay? Whoa, it's a big one, it's a heavy one. We have only a couple of um, outputs here. USB type A, 18 watts. USB type C, 100 watts. And 12 volts, uh, 10 amps here, car cigar lighter. So yes, of course, it's gonna be used on its own, no problem. But it's better to use with um, AC300 because, you know, there are so many outputs here. So I have the outputs, I am the battery. Okay, let's get together. So this is how it works. So uh, the input, okay, or how can we uh, recharge it? So AC input, 500 watts maximum. Solar input, 200 watts maximum. And again, VOC is 12 to 60 watts, uh, volts, excuse me. Uh, car input is 12 to 24 volts from cigarette lighter port. And you can also do AC adapter plus solar input simultaneously, 700 watts of input. Okay, 
Okay, great. So let's talk about the B300 because this is the battery. So the weight is 79.6 pounds heavy. Dimensions, uh, length is 20.5 inches. Okay. The width is 12.5 inches. The height is 10.5 inches. Uh, compact size, I'm not saying like it's super heavy, but like it's definitely not convenient to carry around because just like the weight, but you can just like place it somewhere. And one more thing, you know, uh, about all the bloody portable power stations, you can just place them inside because those are not like gas run generators. They are very quiet. They don't make any noise. Uh, and you just can just place them home. No problem, guys. They look absolutely gorgeous. They look absolutely great. Um, so they will not embarrass anybody, including yourself. Okay, right now for B300, we have the original price of $2,099. And this is not the auction, so the price does not go up here. <laughs> you know, starting price is $2,099. Right now, instead, we want to encourage our live stream viewers because let's face it, we don't have many, right? We only have like a couple of people watching us here and there. So this is because guys, uh, we have just started doing the live streams and not many people know about them. So I encourage you guys to invite your friends, okay? Because if not you, they will never learn, they will never know about the live streams. So please invite your friends. So the price for our viewers is not $2,099, okay? Instead, it's $1,000. 899 I can't believe it. Is that correct guys? Can you check? Because this yes. is like a super low price right now. And if you purchase a bundle, okay, together, which I actually recommend a lot, original price is $3,599. And discounted price is $3,399. Use the link in the comments right now, guys, and be quick because time is limited and quantity is limited. So let's talk about the screen right here. On a 300 we have a very nice and a user-friendly screen, okay? If we could have a close look, let's see what we have here. In the center, on the home page, we have the battery life, okay? So it shows the battery life of the battery it's expanded with. So you can expand up to with four batteries. And um, here we have one battery, it shows the battery percentage, it's 87%, okay? Battery SOC, um, 87%. Battery online, yes, it is online. And battery state is standby. And here, because we can expand with up to four different batteries, uh, sorry, not different, um, up to four same B300 batteries, okay? Um, it shows the battery percentage of each battery. So, then we, when we go back, here on the top, we have PV and uh, we have grid. So this is going to be the input, okay? Is how we charge our B300. And uh, here on the bottom, we have the output. So DC load and AC load. So DC load, this is all of our devices here and here and there. <laughs> and AC load is all of this like wall outlet devices, right? So. When we click on DC load, we can see the total DC output power, the 24, and, and, and then, long story short, we can see the um, DC output power for each of the port, okay? So for example, we can see it for 24 volts, 10 amps output power here, and 12 volts, 30 amps output power here, and USB and um, wireless outputs on the top. So we can see how much power each and every output draws. Okay, let's go back and let's jump to AC load right here. The same thing, output voltage, output power, output frequency is gonna be 60 hertz if we're in America, and output state, stop. Okay, let's go back. On the top, we have the input. So PV, photovoltaic, this is when we charge it from our solar panels. So we can see the DC1 input voltage, DC1 input power, so two input voltage and there's a two input power. Oh, here, grid, if you charge from AC outlet, AC input voltage, AC input power, AC input frequency, gonna be 60 hertz, but here is what really matters, the wattage or the input of AC and the voltage, of course. So 
Here we can turn AC on and DC on and we can turn it off if we want. Now let's go to settings here. So settings, number one, we can choose the language between English and Japanese. Number two, we can um, regulate the AC output here voltage, so 100 volts or 120 volts. But right now, I cannot do this because our AC is on, so we have to turn it off first. Right now, we can do it. We can switch between 100 volts and 120 volts. Okay, uh, let's do 100 volts. AC output frequency, again, 60 hertz um, in America or 50 hertz in some countries. DC one input source. So this is very important. This is the input source. If you charge it from your photovoltaic from the solar panels, please click PV. If you charge from any other, please click others. And the same one here with DC two input source. Okay, let's go next. Eco mode, eco mode off or eco mode on? What is the eco mode? So eco mode is the mode that will help you save battery. So we'll shut down all the AC outlets within four hours of no load or very low load by itself. And uh, here it says the DC outputs will not be affected. This is true. So if you want it to save the battery, please leave the eco mode on. If you don't want, if you probably uh, run a very like low uh, load devices, you know, very low output devices, then maybe you want to turn it off. Okay, then we have single phase here, single phase or split phase because it does support uh, split phase. And we also have working mode here. So if we click on it, because it also is a great UPS, uh, device, you know, so we can choose between standard UPS, time control UPS, PV, priority UPS, and customized UPS. Okay, so we also have a silent mode on and off. Silent mode basically it will not run the fans as loud as um, basically it will be like literally silent. This is maybe if you, you know, place it in your tent when you're camping and you don't want to be bothered by any noise or during power outages when you place in the room. So it has the silent mode here. And maximum grid input current is 15 amps. So we have an advanced mode, Ooh, we won't be covering it today. So, okay, let's click next. We have PV parallel enable, we can enable it or disable it on and off. Uh, we have Bluetooth and uh, Bluetooth is either on or off. Why do we have Bluetooth? Exactly, because we do have an app, guys. And you can see the app, you can scan those QR codes and load the Blady app, or just search Blady. Okay, Blady state, disconnect. So we can connect it to the app, to the app right now, and I have the app on my phone. We can also use Wi-Fi for our app. So Wi-Fi is on or off, and Wi-Fi is saved right now, disconnect. So let's go next, buzzer settings. For the buzzer settings, we have it either on or off. The buzzer settings is when something goes wrong, let's say you have an overheat or an overload, you'll receive like a buzz, okay? So a buzz. So if you want to get notified if something goes wrong, you will probably want to keep the buzz setting on. I recommend that. Okay, then the touch sound. When I click on the screen, guys, you probably can hear the sound, right? So I can actually turn it off. And right now there is no sound. <laughs> Very unsatisfying, I would say. So I want to back on. Uh, the back light brightness. Okay, maybe if you want to use it at night, you can drag the brightness to its minimum. All right, either by dragging it or by just, you know, doing this. Or you can uh, switch the brightness to this maximum when you are outside and it's very light. It's very bright there. So, uh, and also we have the day settings here, okay, and the time setting here. Okay, it's not even it. Next, we have the sleep time. So, the sleep time is basically how much time has to pass uh, before it shuts, down, before the screen just, you know, goes to the sleep mode. 30 seconds, one minute, five minutes, or never. And uh, restore factory settings here. 
not sure. Okay, so let's go back, back, back. Data, product info. We have all the product information. It's very useful if you are uh, running into some problems and you contact the customer service and they say, sir, could I please know the product information? And you say, yeah, is the model, the model, this is the S and code and etc. Next, we have the battery pack, uh, BMS version, and all these other things. Let's go back, battery information. Again, that is what we could see from the main screen, from the home page, the exact percentage of each battery that is connected to A3300, and also the um, other additional information like the battery online or offline, and the battery state. Let's go back, the, the alarm history. Okay, so the alarm history is very important, okay? So we have all those alarms that can happen to, uh, that can happen to the um, portable power station and we have the number for it, we have the occurrence time and we have error code. So in this case, these are the alarms that already happened. So we have the error code and we have the uh, time when it happened. So we can check it, let me show you here in the alarm history. So we have no alarms here, okay. Okay, all right guys, so this is about it. Um, right now it's connected to the app because I have the app. The app is free for Android or iOS, no problem at all. Uh, you can use it with Wi-Fi, so right now I open my Wi-Fi, but you know what, for Wi-Fi you have to actually create the, like the, uh, you have to log in and all this stuff, you have to sign up. So I will use it, I will be using it without my Wi-Fi, just with Bluetooth. So I just search Blatty, okay, this is what the app looks like, Blatty. Let's click on it. Mm-hmm, Blatty welcomes you. And let's press here, connect. Okay, and connect. So I'm connecting it with Bluetooth, hopefully it works. It says, available Blatty devices, AC300, yeah, it is. So, okay, whoa, successfully connected. Okay, thank you, Blady, that was fast. Let me, uh, okay, so there we go, guys. AC300, 87%, the battery, correct. Here we have the PV input, the grid input, the DC output, and the AC output. And can I, oh, yeah, I actually can turn DC on and AC on just from my phone. So this is pretty cool. I don't have to be standing next to the screen. You know, I can do it on my sofa. I can do it when I'm in another room or maybe even outdoors. Uh, not, very, not very far though because it's still Bluetooth. So, okay, and I can turn it off and off right here. This app is like the most advanced app of Blady because uh, for AC300, you can actually turn it off and on uh, I mean the, the output, the outputs. You can see the battery life. And if you click on it, you will see like all this information, like all this information <laughs> is explicit. And uh, if you click on, yeah, the battery again, guess we'll see the package too, status, so the face status and all this stuff. You can click on settings. Anyway, just play with the app guys, it's pretty cool. The app is free. So if you have the AC300 already and you don't have the app, guys, you should definitely download the app. The app is fantastic. I absolutely love the app. You don't have to log in. You can just use it with Bluetooth. However, if you are far from AC300, we do have Wi-Fi, guys. So you can actually use Wi-Fi and control it from anywhere in the world. Isn't that great? So also you can receive updates through the app, right? So you can just update it through the app, guys. And you don't have to be standing next to the screen. Maybe if you're outdoors, it's super, super bright outdoors. You can see the screen very clearly. Go ahead and use your phone, okay? So the question is whether the screen is brighter, brighter here on your phone or here. But uh, anyway, you have the app and the screen, both of them. So please don't blow the app by scanning those QR codes or just by searching on Apple Store and App Store. Okay. So, this is AC300 and B300. 
Do we talk about what we have in the B300 box? Because this fusion cable, it actually comes together with B300. So, Blady B300 expansion battery. First of all, we have this battery expansion cable. It's called P090A. Then we have this solar charging cable. Okay, this is what it looks like. This is the solar charging cable. This is what we have. Then we have the user manual, the QC card, and 48 months of warranty. So this is, this is what we have in the box of B300. And of course you can purchase B300 separately, no problem, you can even use it separately, but you know, in tandem uh, with A300 is just so much better because you have this really like endless, endless ways you can use it um, during, during power outages as your UPS or as a solar generator, things like this. So go ahead and purchase the guest right now. The uh, discounted price is in the, is in the comment section. Click on that link and save a lot of money right now. And also, don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Blady Global, and on YouTube, Blady uh, Official, and also on Instagram, Blady underscore underscore official. So guys, okay, right now mm, we have a recharge. We have a recharge time. So AC. Uh, for if you're charged with AC, it will take you from uh, 6.5 to 7 hours to recharge it. This is 500 watts. If you're charged from your solar panels, the maximum input is 200 watts. So you will be able to charge it uh, within 15.5 uh, to 16 hours. So this with prime sunshine and ideal orientation. If you're charged from your car outlet, uh, 12 volts, 24 volts car outlet. 100 watts, 200 watts, 30 or 15 hours. If you charge it with your AC plus solar, this is going to be 700 watts, five hours. If you're charged with solar and uh, double solar, this is possible with the DO50S charging enhancer that is required separately. We'll talk about it. Uh, you can recharge it within five hours. If you charge with your dual AC, again, 700 watts, you will be able to recharge within just five hours, but again, the second adapter, uh, extra adapter is required. And again, if you want to double the solar input, you can do it with DO50S, DC charting enhancer. So DO50S is pretty interesting. It is not mandatory, like you can actually recharge it without it, but the solar input you can get is limited to 200 watts, and this is the ideal, you know, situation. So you will probably never get 200 watts. <laughs> but like with DO5OS, you can double the input, okay? So DO5OS is pretty interesting. Uh, I was thinking maybe we, we could talk about it for a second. So DO5OS, okay, is, is right here. It's a DC charting enhancer, okay? Let me show it to you. Let me give you a closer look. I have it right here. You probably guys already know DL5S, don't you? So this is what it looks like, okay? It is, um, it's not small, but it's very lightweight. I promise you that. Okay, that's how you connect it to your portable power station. And it comes with some cords, such as our solar panel cord, okay? And also our cigarette lighter cord. Okay, so, the usage of DO50S is different. It's compatible with B230, with B300. It is compatible with many, many portable power stations. Okay. Next. Next. Okay. So, next. Okay. So, no. Anyway, so guys, uh, just let me just put it in simple words. Um, three, three purposes, how, how you can remember that. Number one is to, to maximize the, uh, to double the solar input, okay? So if the solar input is like 600 watts, you can connect more solar panels now, okay? With this DO5OS, and you can get solar input up to 100, uh, 1,200 watts 
if the solar input was original like 700 watts, you can get like right now 1,400 watts because you can connect right now more solar panels with this DO50S. Speaking about how to connect it, guys, you can just uh, find a video on Blatty support um, on YouTube, okay? Very explicit tutorial how to, how to connect it. Actually very easy, just kind of uh, hard to show it right now here in the live stream. Okay, uh, the, the second option is to give a more charging methods to those portable power station of ours that could not be charged with like cigarette lighter port before or with solar panels before or could not be extended with B230 or B300. Right now models like AC200, AC200P can be extended, expanded with those batteries with the help of DO50S. This is how you want to remember uh, the purpose of DO50S. Okay, uh, we do have a special discount for it too, guys. You can see it on the screen right now. Right now, let's talk about um, uh, AC300. So, uh, okay, so 240 volts split phase bonding. Yes, it does have it because you can connect four batteries to it. So it does have split bonding. Uh, pass through charting. Does it have a pass through charting? Yes, it does. Uh, the weight of B300 battery is. So it's 79.6 pounds. Dimensions are the length is 20.5 inches. The width is 12.5 inches. The height is 10.5 inches. The operating temperature anywhere from minus four to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. And the storage temperature is from 14 to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Certification, it has a bunch of those like UL standards, CSC, DOE, FCCA, Prop 65. And it has the warranty of 48 months, 48 months of warranty. So this is guys, uh, about our B300. Uh, okay, and uh, let's keep moving, guys. Again, those discounts, you can see them on the screen right now, okay? So uh, the link is in the description. Right now, let's load some devices with our B300 and AC300. Let's, tr let's try to load some devices right now, okay? Also, we already prepared some data for you guys. So, for example, right now, let's use the sandwich maker, okay? This is definitely an AC. I want to turn AC on. And okay, so let's take a look. 200 to 400. Good, good, good. This is spike right now. Will it drop down or not? Okay, it's around 437 watts from our AC uh, output. Okay, right now let's do our coffee machine. Coffee, uh, no, this is, is going to be an ice machine. Okay, it's on already. It's working. Okay, so 441 was pretty good, pretty good. Okay, so far so good. Okay, next one is, is our uh, juicer or our blender. So let's have some juice guys right now. We have a power outage, let's say, and uh, we still want to have <laughs> a rich and fulfilled life. So we want to plug in our juice and it's gonna be loud, so let's go for it, okay. Okay guys, so as you can see, the auto power was like uh, 600, more than 600 watts. Right now it dropped down back to 435 because we're done with the juice. And we're running a sandwich maker, an ice machine, and a juicer and a bladder at the same time, okay? Three devices at the same time. Yeah, it's on already, don't worry. So uh, right now we can plug in more devices if you want, guys, but you actually got the point. So here it can handle uh, 3,000 watts. We only have like 544, so we can do much, much, much more. And we also only using AC devices right now. So I can also uh, turn on DC on and put my phone on the top because the charting, the wireless charting is DC. Oops, 99% right now, and it's zero because it's just like the load is two, oh, four, okay, it's showing. Four watts, okay, so five watts, good. Uh, my phone is on the top. Okay, so we prepared some data for you guys and we prepared the data for like really energy consuming devices. Let's say that you use a coffee maker with your A300 and B300, okay? So your coffee maker, if it's 2000 watts, you will be able to make 136, 140 cups. Uh, at the same time, let's take a look here, it's 529 watts. What is taken? Uh, why, why did it go up? What happened? So probably the ice maker is working and the sandwich working right now. So 533 watts. Okay. 
Let's check the frequency is 60 hertz, good. The outer voltage is 100.2 volts, okay. As promised, 100 to 120 volts and uh, 530, 29 watts, very good. Okay, let's check the battery, 85%. What it was originally 87, right? So, okay, good. So, guys, then if you're using an electric grill, let's say it's like 1650 watts, you can use the electric grill for two hours. If you use a refrigerator, which is very realistic because you're in the power outage, oh, guys, this is, very, this is gonna be very helpful during power outages. So, uh, if your refrigerator is 150 watts, right, actually anywhere from 150 to, 100, to 1200 watts. You can run your fridge from 30 to 56 hours. If using your air conditioner, which is like 8,000 BTU, normal, six to 14 hours. If using with your CPAP, 40 watts, you can use for 80 plus hours. If you use it with a light, like 10 watts, you can run the light for, 10, for 100 plus hours. Oh my God, guys, that is a lot of hours. So <clears throat> one more time, Discounts are only available during the live stream. Okay, so original price is $2,099. For B300 is $2,099, and discounted price is $1,899. Okay, and uh, for the bundle, original price is $3,599, and discounted price is $3,399. Discounts are in the, in, the, in the comments, okay, the link, the link is there. So please guys, click that link and save a lot of money. And you guys can see all the discounts here on the screen. Okay, right now we have our second giveaway time. Very good, very lucky time is about to happen right now. So let's see who is our K2 power, power bank winner. We give away our K2 power bank, okay. As we promised, we announced winners we announce winners every 20 minutes. So who is our winner? This time is winner from Facebook, okay? And the winner is Juan Pablo. <laughs> Juan, congratulations. Please kindly contact Avalyn at bloody.com. And congratulations, you won a K2 power bank, 130 watts that can charge your phones, your laptops, your other gadgets. It's a really cool power bank. Congratulations, Juan. Juan Pablo, one more time. Guys, if you want to win, uh, all you want to do is just to like follow us, to give us a like, to share with your friends, and to be active in the comments, okay? Thank you so much, guys. All right, here are all the discounts. Here are our social platforms, guys. Please follow us there. Bloody Global on Facebook, Bloody Unscore Official on Instagram and YouTube. And also visit our website, bloodypower.com. Okay. So you can also, guys, get our DO50S DC turning enhancer. Again, guys, you remember the purpose of it. Uh, first of all, it's compatible with B230, B300, EB150, EB240, AS200, AS200P, and AS200 Max. So the first and the most important um, purpose is to enable more charging methods like solar, like car, elite, accident battery, charting. The second one is to increase or better to double the solar input. So for Blady A200 or A200P, it is up to 1,200 watts. For Blady uh, A200 Max, it's 1,400 watts. And third is to increase the overall capacity of the Blady A200P, for example, or A200, because right now it can be expanded with B230 or B300 batteries. It couldn't be expanded without the O5OS, this is turning enhancer, but with it, it can. So this is for A200 and A200P. For A200 Max, for example, it can already be expanded without the O5OS. So guys, uh, just think if you need it, you know, for these purposes, you can get it right now with a special discounted price, $199, marked down to $159. Use the link in the comments, please, guys. The price is the best right now during the live stream. Please be very, very quick. Okay, and also DO50S comes with the cables that we already shown to you, but hey, one more time, wouldn't go amiss. So this is our solar, okay, to get into solar, solar uh, batteries, solar panels, yeah. Next is uh, our car charging cable. Okay, 
There we go. So this all comes with DO50S together. And again, original price is $199. Discount price is $159. This is all great, guys. So again, all the links are available only during the live stream. Please make sure that you click um, them in the, com in the comments. We used to have those codes, guys, remember? We used to have the codes. Right now, we don't have the codes. We have uh, discounted links. Okay, great. We still have solar panels that we want to talk about and I am very excited about it. So let's go for it, guys. Let's go for it. So we prepared, um, we brought some solar panels here in the studio. So number one, we we're gonna be talking about PV120. And by the way, our sandwich is ready right now. So let me put it on the floor. It's a big one, okay, let me disconnect it. You see, once I unlocked it, it gives me a beat because alarm, what is the alarm? Because, you know, I unlocked it right now. So let's first turn it off. Okay. And then we can unlock it right now and plug it out. Okay. So let me put it on the, on the floor right now and let me show you the solar panels because solar panels are big. All right. So, this was our AC300 and B300. Ooh, heavy. Heavy, but you know what? It's still portable. So, uh, sure it's heavy, but first of all, you can buy some trolleys, you know, and it's literally portable. So, especially if you live in a van, or let's say not live in a van, but like if you in your van a lot of time, put it in a van, no problem at all, right? So, depends on your lifestyle, guys. Okay, this is PV120. Let's open it up. Bladder solar panels are so beautiful, and they're also of a compact size. You can't deny it. They have a compact size. They are beautiful. They are just fantastic. Everybody loves them. <laughs> uh, so, uh, this is Bladder PV120 solar panel. The weight is 12.57 pounds. Um, dimensions unfolded is 21 by 65 inches and dimensions folded are 21 by 18.5 inches. So this is the size of it, guys. You can see we have bigger ones. The power, the maximum solar input you can get is 120 watts, okay? Lamination is ETFE. Cell type is monocrystalline silicon. Cell efficiency is up 23.4%. Voltage max power is 19.6 volts. Current and max is 6.1 amps. And open circuit voltage is 24.4 volts. And short circuit voltage, short, short circuit current is 6.43 uh, amps. Don't worry if you didn't catch it. We have all those tech specifications here as well as all those cards right here, okay? And all those like technical details here, we have them in English and in Japanese. So you don't have to be writing down what I'm saying right now, guys, we have it all here. And we also have all this info on bloodypower.com. So go ahead and visit our website too. What does the successful solar panel charting depends on? One of the key factors is the angle we place the solar panels at. Right? Correct. So here we have this like ancient Egyptian whatever thing. Like this is a really cool thing. I love it a lot. So this is the angle. We can regulate the, the angle, okay, of our solar battery. Of our, of our yeah, basically said right. So because we are in a studio, we don't have the sun here, guys. We don't see the sun. So right now, I want to put it at the right angle to the sun and it works perfectly. I like how easy it is to use and right now you see guys, hands free <laughs> and I'm ready to use it. I'm ready to get energy from uh, sun, from the sun. Okay, so this is PV120 and 120 stands for the maximum input of 120 watts, okay? So if you want more, we have it, we have more. 
So we didn't bring it though, but we do have some other solar panels, guys, too. So please um, visit our website, bladypower.com, and check our solar panels. We have PV200, we have PV350. So let's take a look at PV300. PV200 is quite similar to this one. So the weight is 16.1 pounds. Dimensions unfolded are 23.2 by 89.2 inches. Dimensions folded are 23.2 by 24.8 inches, okay? And again, guys, it, uh, today we only gave you a special price. So just think about it. Original price of the 200, okay, with a maximum solar input of 200 watts. The original price is $499. Discounted price is $349.30. So this is how much it is discounted right now. Um, the code is will be on the screen. Okay, let's talk about PV200. So it is uh, obvious from the name that the maximum input is 200 watts, okay, as opposed to PV120 has the maximum input of 120 watts. The lamination is ETFE, the cell type is monocrystalline silicon, again, it's the same as PV120, that's why I say they almost look identical, um, one is bigger. So, cell efficiency is up to 23.4%. Voltage at max uh, power is 20.5 volts. Current at max power is 9.7 amps. Open circuit voltage or OCV is 26.1 volts. Short circuit current is 10.3 amps. And operating temperature is from 14 to 149 degrees Fahrenheit. The best temperature is around 77 degrees Fahrenheit. Also, I would love to mention that it's so compact because when you fold it, it's really easy to carry around. It's really easy to hang on your van, to place it at any angle. So because of these things we have on the back, right? We can place it at any angle. It's really nice. So here we can control the, the angle, right? I really love it a lot. You don't have to get handy on how to, you know, how to place it correctly. Just try, experiment, and you will absolutely love it. Here we have this solid carrying handles here, okay? And all those cords are put in this bag. Very nice. And here we also have this uh, technical details, okay? All right, great, guys. So this is PV200. Again, the special price is only available right now, guys. Please make sure you use the this opportunity to save a lot of money right now and only right now. And we don't have much time left. We only have like 20 minutes before the end of the live stream. Which brings me to our next solar panel, which is Blady PV350. So let me, oh, sorry. Let me uh, forward it back. And PV350 is big, okay? So we tried to unfold it last time and I checked the comments afterwards and you guys were laughing that all those like promo codes on the screen and me, um, we take less space than PV350. PV350 is a big portable power station. And you know what? I thought just you, you love how big it is. So we just kind of wanted to do it one more time. Okay, great. So here it is. Okay, PV350. Um, as it says from the name, the maximum solar input is 350 watts. Whoa. So, I know we have a big home, guys. Uh, if you live in the south, you have a big house, have a lot of sun there. <laughs> this is like the, uh, everything you can see, guys, right now. It's just the black solar panel. Okay, so I think you probably are convinced enough right now at this point. So it's so big for a reason. It's so big, actually, the, the, because it's so big, you know, it can give you the maximum it, input of 350 watts. And still when folded, it looks like a nice bag, right? It looks like, probably not, but like it's still very compact and it's possible to carry around. The elimination is ETFE. The cell efficiency is the same, 23.4%. The maximum power voltage is 37.5 volts. The current at max power is 9.2 amps. The open circuit voltage is 46.5 volts. 
and short circuit current is 10.8 amps. The operation temperature is uh, 14 to 149 degrees Fahrenheit and the best temperature is 77 degrees Fahrenheit. The folding number, we have four of them, very big and powerful. Is, uh, it is able to recharge your solar panels or other devices real fast. So guys, if you have a place to put it somewhere, don't has it, go and get it right now, especially taken into account. Right now, during the lesson, we have this special price that is only available during the live stream. So please, guys, make sure that you use this opportunity and save a lot of money. This is PV or photovoltaic 350, okay? So 350 watts of maximum solar input is there. What actually, what um, factors are important when you charge from solar? So number one, of course, you better turn it on a solar day, okay? Because solar intensity is still very important. Number two, the angle you place the solar panel at, okay? And with this smart design, guys, that we have right here, it's very easy to set the right angle, okay? Oh, this is, yeah. So number three is the ambient temperature, okay? So it doesn't have to be too hot, doesn't have to be too cold. The best one is actually 77 degrees Fahrenheit, okay? And then also the length of the cord to connect the solar panel to the uh, portable power station, let's say. So our length is of course optimal. Okay, all right now let's talk about dimensions of a PV350. The weight is 30.6 pounds. The dimensions unfolded are length is 94.4 inches. The width is 35.6 inches. The dimensions folded, the length is <clears throat> uh, 35.6 inches, the width is 24.5 inches, and the height is 2.5 inches. The warranty, 24 months. So this is what you get, guys. <clears throat> and as you guys can see, I'm here accompanied by all those uh, promo codes, so please use them right now. Um, for some of them, for this portable power stations, if you don't see the promo code, then go to the comments, okay, and click on that discounted link that is in the comments on YouTube or on Facebook. And for our port, for our yeah, those are still portable solar panels. You can see discounted codes. So let's go over it one more time. For P120. Original price is $299 and discounted price is $223.30. The code is LivePV120. Our codes are so easy to guess. But anyway, uh, the second one is PV200. Original price is $499 and discounted price is $349.30. The code is LivePV200. PV350 that I have right here. Original price is $849. Discounted price is $559.30. The code is LIFEPV350. Imagine someone just bought it, paying the, full, paying the original price, and this is your friend. I didn't call him or her to our live stream. I told you guys, call your friends to the live stream. Not just to do us a favor, but also, you know, help your friends save a lot of money, okay? And don't forget to follow us to keep in touch and to stay in the know about the best prices ever. But you know what? The best prices ever are, of course, during the live stream, okay? So make sure to follow us on wherever you are, Facebook or YouTube or Instagram or all of them. Okay, so guys, these are a huge discount of ours that are only valid for 15 more minutes. Right now, we have one more giveaway. We give away our hat, okay? So let's see who our lucky winner is. Giveaway time. If you wanna be a winner, be active in the comments. And goes without saying, also be our follower. Okay, so this time our winner is from YouTube. I want to congratulate our winner from YouTube. Good job, you got it. You probably have been very active in the comments and our winner from YouTube and make sure you type one in the comments so we know you are here is Cameron Sauter from YouTube. Okay, Cameron Sauter. 
please kindly contact Avalon at Blatty.com within 48 hours. You got our nice hat. Congratulations on that. I think that hat is absolutely fantastic. You know, I think this hat is great. So guys, <clears throat> again, if you want to win, be active in the comments. I want you to remind all the codes again because all the codes are only valid during the live stream. So please make sure that you, yeah, right, yeah, you use all of those discounts right now. And this is my favorite hat, you know? So it's like, looks really cool, I think. <laughs> This is the hat. So absolutely unisex, says Blueetti. Uh, no one will guess what it is unless people are uh, our products users, you know, ask, hey, what is Blueetti? And you're like, oh, it's like Secret Illuminati Club. I'm in. Like, wow, can I be there? Yeah, and it is share our link to the live stream. Okay, guys. So right now, let's just kind of recap what we just uh, talked about today. We spent two hours together. I hope you loved it. We haven't done yet. We still have 15 minutes, guys. So come down, come down. We still have time, okay? Don't freak out. I know I know that discounts are here only during this 15 minutes. I know it's kind of really stressful, but at the same time, hey, glass half full. We still have 15 minutes to use all those discounts and promo code. So breathe in, breathe out. Go to bladypower.com enter those promo codes or just go to the comment section and click on those links and save a lot of money right now. Guys, remember AC50S, super lightweight, super portable, 300 watts, AC pure insulin inverter, 400 watts surge, 500 watts of massive capacity, lithium iron phosphate battery, and yeah, there we go, exactly. All of the codes are here again, guys. Where have you been? We've been waiting for you all the time. Finally, you're back. 11 outputs for multiple devices, three ways to recharge it, AC, solar, car generator, 120 volts, uh, 20, 120 20 watts of maximum solar input, a light and a user-friendly screen is all here. Okay, okay guys, your health. Original price is $379, discount price is $299. Original price is $379, discount price is $299. <clears throat> Coming next is our <coughs> Entschuldigung, EB55. So EB55 is right here in blue, gray, and orange. EB55 original price is $499, and discount price is $499. $49. So 700 watts, 537 watts hour lithium iron fossil battery, 2500 plus life cycles, 12 outputs, six ways to recharge it, AC, solar call generator, <clears throat> um, AC plus solar, and dual AC. The maximum solar input is 200 watts. Actually, make sure you place it like this, okay? Don't play with this too much because it has to be placed correctly. Okay, um, and then we're moving to EB70S. So EB70S is like a bigger sister of EB55. It comes in blue, red, gray, and green. Choose your favorite one. 800 watts, AC pure and standard order, 1,400 watts, search. Original price is $569, and its current price is $499. Lithium iron phosphate battery. Again, those batteries that are like the best, and it's and in its niche, they are really, really good. They have a, an outstanding lifespan, like a really long lifespan. 2,500 plus life cycles in this case. 12 outputs, while turning output on the top, and Six ways to recharge it, 200 watts of solar input. Original price, one more time, is $569. Discount price is $499. Guys, all of those links, discounts, promo codes are only valid during the live stream. <clears throat> one more time, this is a very powerful 800 watts AC personal inverter portable power station. Next is DO50S DC charging enhancer. Quite big, but still super lightweight, okay? Compatible with B230, B300, EB150, EB240, AC200, AC200P, 
and AC200 Max. Three functions. Number one, to enable more charging methods to some older portable power station of ours. These can be solar, car, and lead access battery charging. Number two, to double the solar input, okay? So for AC200 or for AC200P, it can be as high as 1,200 watts. And for AC200 Max, it can be as high as 1,400 watts. And number three is to increase the overall capacity of Blady AC200 and AC200P by enabling them to be, connect, to be connected to B230 or B300. Original price for DO5OS is 199 dollars. Discounted price is 149 dollars. It comes with two cables with a solar panels cable and with a car charging cable. The cables are included so when you purchase uh, our DO5OS you also get those two cables in the in the box. Okay guys, right now we have some questions or what? Oh yeah, we have questions and by the way, I love your questions. So if you have any, let us know. What kind of solar panel should I choose for E55? Thank you for your question. So, PV input requirement for E55, let's go over it. Open circuit voltage or OCV for short is from 12 to 28 volts, okay? So then the input power is 200 watts max. It includes the MC4 connector. We highly recommend our Blady PV120 because we will be able to charge just within five hours. So five hours, it's really cool. Nice time, five, 5.5, five, point five, five, five and a half. For reference only, of course, you can choose any solar panel, but we highly recommend ours because we just think those is the best. Yes, we are a little bit biased. Okay, so thank you for your question, guys. Does EB70S support Blady App support, uh, Blady App control? EB70S does not have an app control, but EB70S does have a very user-friendly sc uh, screen right here. As you guys can see, we have the input, we have the output, we have the frequency, we have the battery life. Very minimalistic, right? Minimalist over there. Do you like it? I think it's absolutely great. Okay, so Blady AC300 inverter modular solar generator. Okay, uh, this is its battery B300. And uh, Blady AC300 is bigger, but actually not as heavy as B300. So original price of AC300 is $1,899 and discounted price is $1,699, okay? The code uh, or better, the, uh, the do we have the code, do we have the link? I'm not certain, but guys, anyway, check the comments or check if we have any codes discounts here, mm, either in the comments or you will see a promotional code on the screen right here to many of those. So please use it right now. We all, oh, we only have uh, seven minutes left, okay. So, uh, Blady AC300, just one more time, let's go over the, the main points. 3000 watts AC pure and sine wave inverter, Three, uh, 6000 watts surge. When it's expanded with one B300, and you can only expand it with, uh, with B300. Uh, you have the capacity of uh, 3072 watts hour. And uh, if you expand it with, uh, yeah, with four of B300s, you will get a capacity of 12,288 watts hour. Now, the chemistry here doesn't have any chemistry because it does not have any battery, but when we're talking about B300, the chemistry inside is lithium iron phosphate battery life PO4 uh, with 3,500 plus life cycles before the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. The bond, the split bond, it, bonding is, it does have 240 volt split phase bonding. It does have the UPS function, home backup 24 seven, and seven ways to recharge it, like AC, solar, car, generator, lead exit battery, dual AC, and AC plus solar. The maximum solar input is 2,400 watts. The maximum fast dual charging is 5,400 watts. Um, this is a solar and AC simultaneously. 
The original price is $1,899 and its current price is $1,699. So guys, make sure to use it right now. Scots, I mean. Okay, B300 expansion battery. Capacity is 3,072 watts hour. And as you can see, it's only one. Okay, so we will have more. We can connect it to four different batteries, to, to four B300s. Okay, capacity is 3,072 watts hour, 51.2 uh, volts and 60 amps hour. Type our battery is again lithium iron phosphate, 3,500 plus life cycles before the battery drops to 80% of its original capacity. Then we have the management system here, MPPT controller and BMS system. We also have some outputs here. We have three outputs. We have a USB-A 18 watts output. We have a USB-C 100 watts output. And we have 12 volts DC 10 amps car cigarette lighter port here. Okay, guys, and if you purchase the bundle, which is, of course, a very good idea, well, we also have a special price for the bundle right now. For, so for the bundle for AC300 and for uh, B300, original price is $3,599. And right now, discounted price is $3,499. So you're saving like $100 or so. Please use the code, please use the links. Uh, they're, they're only there for a limited amount of time. Okay, let's see, my mind to AC300. Hopefully, guys, you, will, you can get it right now. You still have five minutes left, so guys, please be quick. Next, we talked about our solar panels because, bloody, it's all about solar panels. It's all about green energy, okay? So, we want to make sure all of our portable power stations are rechargeable with solar panels. And we do have our own solar panels too. So this is the PV120 solar panel. Original price is $299. Discounted price is $223.30. The material is ETFE monocrystalline silicon. So efficiency is up 23.4%. Uh, the voltage at max power is 19.6 volts. Current at max power is 6.1 amps. Open circuit voltage is 24.4 volts and short circuit current is 6.43 amps. Okay, one more time, the price right now is only 223.3. So please use the discounted code you can see on the screen right now. Next is PP200 solar panel. It looks very similar to this one. So for the sake of saving you the time, we will not be showing it right now. Again, the power, the maximum power is 200 watts. The lamination is ETFE, monocrystalline silicon. Cell efficiency is 23.4%, voltage max power is 20.5 volts, current max is 9.7 amps, open circuit voltage is 26.1 volts, aperture current is 10.3 amps. And original price is $499. Discounted price is $349, guys. Please be quick right now, only two minutes left. Okay, and then the big guy is PV350 with 350 watts of maximum solar input. There we go, guys. So again, the maximum solar input is 350 watts and the lamination is ETFE, okay? So ETFE lamination, cell efficiency is up to 23%, 23.4%. Uh, maximum power voltage is 35, 37.5 volts. Uh, current at max power is 9.2 amps. Open circuit voltage is 46.5 volts. And the price right now, guys, is originally it's 849, but right now it's only 559, guys. 849 drops down to only 549, and we only have one minute left before the end of our live stream. Guys, please be quick. All those promo codes are still valid. Go to bladypower.com and use them or just click the link in the description, on, in, not in the comments. Click the link in the comments on YouTube or on Facebook. And we'll see each other again on July the 14th at 7 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, okay? So July the 14th, 7 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. One more time, all those discounts, guys, please be quick. They expire in one minute. Go to bladypower.com enter those promo codes or just click on the link you can see in the comments section right now. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram, on 
Facebook, on Twitter, and don't forget to visit our website, bladedpower.com. And guys, set your alarm clocks for the next time, July the 14th, 7 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, okay? Hopefully, guys, you were able to purchase those portable power stations of Blady and uh, those solar panels. Congratulations to our winners. Congratulations to those guys who used discounts and saved a lot of money, guys. And I hope I will see you next time. So come again on July the 14th, 7 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. I'll see you there and take care.